gears 2, 4, 6 and 8 are difficult or impossible to engage. The instrument reads GS malfunction. Star diagnosis reports fault code 232.21. MBE solenoid valve has an open circuit. The gear module was checked and no fault was found. Possible fault source from studying the wiring diagram. The gear module is actuated by the GS control unit. YS service bulletin on fault indication. Based on the control unit number, the following items must be replaced. GS control unit valve seats for the solenoid valves of the splitter group. Use star diagnosis to read out the clutch parameters and clutch wear. Note, the new control unit differs from the old one, wiring to the circuit board. Wires are susceptible to breakage at the connection point. Wiring on new control units has been changed to eliminate the risk of breakage. Valve seats for the solenoids of the splitter group have been modified. Proceed with replacing the relevant components. Remove the valve seats using special pliers. Place seal rings on the new valve seats and apply grease. Insert the two valve seats and press them firmly into place. Remove and replace the housing seal. Note, always replace all seals. Replace the seal rings on the solenoid valves. Dispose of the old gear shift control unit in accordance with applicable laws. Next, disassemble the intermediate plate from the old control unit and replace the seals. Apply sufficient grease to all seals, except the two red housing seals. Note, the red seals do not move. Install the intermediate plate on the new control unit and mount the control unit vent. Set the solenoid valves in place and attach the housing. Identify the gate module with modified valve seats using a blue marking. Use star diagnosis to transfer the clutch values from the old control unit. To initiate the major teach-in process, press both buttons on the shift control unit and switch on the ignition. Start the engine after you hear the acknowledgement tone Keep the buttons pressed until the end of the procedure. The system will shift up and down automatically through all the gears. The procedure is complete when the display shows neutral.